um, the average weight loss was 24% greater in the high protein group. So they okay. lost 24%. And you said it was isocaloric between the two groups, that's but right. was it subcaloric overall? Meaning it was. people were it was ingesting. A five, that's a very smart, yes. It was 500 calories less than what they needed to maintain body weight. Correct. Okay, got it. So 24% yep. more weight loss total. Total. In the group that distributed their protein evenly in and followed the so-called yes. zone diet, 40, and 30, 30. they lost more fat than the high-carbohydrate group. So the high-protein group lost uh, a total of 16 pounds versus the calorie-controlled group lost 11 pounds. Of fat. A fat, which is great. Everyone's at home thinking, this is wonderful. Isocaloric. Isocaloric. But the, the thing here is the lean body mass change. So again, this was done using DEXA, and we know DEXA only looks at lean body mass. You mentioned DEXA earlier. Just very briefly, is DEXA, it, how does DEXA work? Um, it, not, not, a, not at a mechanistic level. What, what does it look like? I go into the clinic. Am I floating in water? No, am you're I holding? Scanned. I'm yeah. holding the the paddles. Well, you might be because you're Andrew yeah. Huberman. But, <laughs> no, no, no. But um, um, yes. you hold the paddles and it um, and you're standing on something. It's 